Breathable nail polish brands claim that they allow water vapor to go through them. And they use something that's called K-polymer in their formulation. K-polymer is also known as hydroxyethyl methacrylate. And this is a substance that's used in the production of contact lenses. Now contact lenses are silicone based and when they combine with this K-polymer, it allows them to allow moisture to go through them. However, nail polish is made with nitrocellulose as a base. And unlike contact lenses, K-polymer cannot bind with nitrocellulose the way it can bind with silicone. And for this reason, breathable nail polish cannot allow water vapor or water to go through it. Think about it this way. If I told you that if you want to run at 100 miles an hour, just drink some jet fuel. Sounds ridiculous, right? The reason is because your body doesn't metabolize jet fuel the same way an airplane does. And drinking jet fuel will most likely land you in the hospital. Now, the Tuesday in Love formula does not use K-polymer. Instead, we use our patented TIL permeability complex. And this unique substance binds to the nitrocellulose base and alters it to make it water permeable. What's also interesting is that the adhesive molecules in here, or the glue that holds it to your nails, is also water permeable. And for this reason, anytime you do the water permeability tests, you'll notice that breathable nail polishes don't actually allow water to go through, and the Tuesday in Love formula does. So guys, I hope that gives you a little bit more insight into the claims of breathability and a little better understanding of K-polymer. If you have any questions or comments, be sure to leave them, give us a like and follow. And of course, always stay smart and always stay in love.